the funny thing is, if they really didn't respect my research, that's surely not what they were telling me beforehand. Uh, one thing I've kind of learned from producers is the more they try to butter you up, the more they probably dislike you. And in this case, uh, they were telling me beforehand, the producer, how much they appreciated my research and how important it was to go and try to get balance for their movie, that it was really important for them to have balance. And uh, I was supposed to be the balance, mm -hmm. and we ended up not having any. Not having any balance at all. I cannot believe... I, I mean, the three hours long, it sounds, as like, it sounds as though the interview was more like they were trying to debate you as opposed to interview you. It was pretty grueling. Uh, I, was, I was kind of exhausted after four hours, but they, they had come well prepared. She had a phalanx of producers giving her lists of questions to go and answer, and they took a brief break in the minute, middle to try to decide what new questions that they should ask. But... Uh, I guess I was worried that they would take the four hours and turn it into like two minutes or something. Mm -hmm. You know, you have somebody, you know, look kind of what Katie Kirk did to Sarah Palin when she interviewed her basically for over a, a week, I guess, during the uh, right. 2000 presidential campaign. And she was able to get, I don't know, maybe five, ten minutes of uh, footage from there to make her, you know, out of context, I'm sure even then, to make her look bad.